about to do a video on a, a nice subject that I feel like, and you feel like too, I'm sure, is going to be a, a, a eye opener for some. For the people in the back, the slow. Let's get into this video. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Y'all already know who I got in the building with me. That's right. You got your girl, Tootie Two. Tootie Two in the mother and build it you dig what i'm saying before we go any further make sure y'all like comment subscribe and share this video you dig what i'm saying and uh what the goddamn hell yeah league all right from one two to two can you cut on that good fan right there yes, I, sure can. Uh, uh, I sure appreciate it all right so um y'all know it's been a lot going on these past few days and which is nothing that will be discussed in this video however I do want to speak on something that has been said and it's simply one thing. And we're going to make this an eight minute video as, as, as eight minutes as we can. Okay. All right. I guess this was a question slash statement or just straight up to the point. Are y'all working with each other for views? I'm going to put it in a question. You want me to answer that? You can answer that. Hell yeah. That's what I thought. Cause yeah. it's a hell yeah for me too. I'm just saying, like, who, what, <laughs> what, what the fuck? I don't. Yeah. So here's my chill. thing, right? You gotta chill. Ever since we got together, I mean, it's just been a lot going on, right? That we didn't expect, cause we genuinely was just trying to mind our business and make a few videos. All right. But I've watched couple after couple, friend after friend, YouTuber after YouTuber. They got together. They did collaborations. Did it for views. Facts. They did it for views. Facts. They did it for a come up. They did it uh, uh, to help each other to it go to the next level. Entertainment. It's for a vast amount of reasons. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I didn't even. It's so appalling that that's even <laughs> that even that's even a question to me. You know what I'm saying? What's troublesome to me is that people be feeling like, all right. Um, I think I seen one comment. Um. I think the, the girl said something along the lines like, um, you could tell this friendship with, 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 with Toot and Neek is fake and it's almost cringy. I think that was something along the lines of that. First of all, Get them we, together, we, we, we just started collabing. So I don't understand how anybody could be best friends at that, okay? Um, of course, you're going to look for opportunities to where you could be able to expand or elevate. And if anybody been watching YouTube for the time I've been watching YouTube, the only way to do that is through collabs, is through like, you know what I'm saying, branching out and networking with other people. But this is my problem that I have. Okay. You know what I'm saying? People always look at it, oh my God, they, it, 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 you know, it's, it's not genuine and such and such and such. It's so cringy. I mean, it's amazing how people look at it that way instead of saying, damn, shawty, it's too, look at these two, you know what I'm saying, um, black women out here trying to put their little heads together to goddamn make some bread. And that's what it should be about. It should be about the networking to come up. You know what I'm saying? People be, people can miss me with that shit. Hell yeah, I'll be motherfucking around here for some views. Who wouldn't be? Like, I mean, is that a question? I, th I just think that we needed to, it was my idea. And, and we need to start with saying who idea was who because y'all got me fucked up on that too. <laughs> this was my idea. I think that we should say this on camera to get that on out the way. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Because it's like, you know, they did that shit for views, uh, uh, got together and started doing fake this, fake that. Y'all, entertainment don't have fake in front of it or behind it. It's entertainment. I always told y'all, in movies, y'all ain't complaining to uh, Warner Brothers. I ain't heard nobody complain to Tyler Perry. Shut it, this whole Aside YouTube. from his wigs. His wigs his be wigs terrible. For, Them right. wigs are so terrible. Yo, dog. But okay. Seriously, but it's just like, bro, the whole YouTube is entertainment. And if you don't understand that by now, then it ain't something I can explain. You should get off. Straight up, bro. If you that. don't understand what un entertainment is, you should get off. And you know another thing I want to address, because they think that when we, when we, uh, our voice projects like this, we're mad. Oh, I no. cannot stand that. No. Yo, I'm not. I'm so. This is the happiest I've ever been in my life. 
I'm not even gonna lie to you. I can't go to those lengths. Just things that I need well, to fix. I'm happy as hell. I mean, those things I need to fix. But dog, I'm I'm <laughs> already my voice already project. You know right. what I'm saying? I would. I have the. I have a Napoleon complex. I've always been like that. So sometimes if I'm getting passionate about something or even I'm excited about something, my voice will elevate. Yeah. But that don't mean that I'm bothered at all. You know what I'm saying? I haven't been bothered for a minute. You know what I'm saying? That's like so seriously, is it's just that. But I don't understand how people can even like. Uh, not know that you know what I'm saying yes I feel like you are a cool person you know what I'm saying or whatever but shit nigga I can't say oh yeah that's my that's my nigga right now because we just we just got together dog we just we just met a friendship is something you got to build on that's nigga I love the vibes this shit's been good vibes we work very good together bro but you know what I'm saying people is always thinking see when YouTube niggas get so excited they do. it's like they see two people together and all of a sudden they go from they want us to go together they want us to go together. You know what I'm saying? Just in in like, a minute, they gonna say we dating. Yo, you know, I think two and this has happened to me before. Yo, dog, that's some crazy. I think shit. two and Nick like each other. They yes. gonna break up with they wives yes. and shit. <laughs> like not saying that would be a bomb ass storyline. Though we could probably get a milli off that breaking up with uh, with Shamika and TT to be together. Run off. I'm with it. <laughs> Long yeah. as you put it, honey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if y'all don't y'all, fucking y'all stop chill. in a minute, I'm telling you, we're going to see a whole lot of memes and shit. But I'm not going to cap. It come with the territory. I can't act like uh, all the groups that did get together didn't go through some shit like this. They it's going to happen. It, it's it's, gonna it's happen. definitely going to happen. But one thing that happened in all of those groups that didn't change is that they kept their eyes on the prize. You know what I'm saying? And that's how they were able to just be able to elevate. Bro, listen. It's nothing more, nothing less. You know what I'm saying? We are two black women trying to get it. We ain't trying Period. to do nothing. Trying to, I mean, we're two black women getting. I'm, oh, okay. This nigga changed, yeah, changed the, change the mindset. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But that's what it is. And I mean, people should applaud that. You know what I mean? When you think about shit right now. All right, let's, a prime example. Mm. You know what I'm saying? We got Nikki and Cardi. Right? Okay. Yeah. Dopest women in the industry. Facts. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, you got Drake, you got Chris Brown, and Meek Mill. We'll throw them in there too, okay. right? Hottest niggas in the in the industry, okay? Now, mm -hmm. you looked at the point where Drake, Chris Brown, and even Meek Mill, they all fell out, okay? They or whatever like that, they did. And mm -hmm. it was just like, man, that's the dumbest thing in the world. Y'all the hottest things in the world. Dumbest but you thing. know what they figure out before women figure out? What? You know what I'm saying? As men, they're like, you know what? Shut it. We got to keep this emotional shit. Kick that to the side. Who bro. Got time for because it. we could make more money. Now right. you got the song with Chris Brown and Drake. You got the right. song with, with Drake and Meek Mill. Right. And they all did numbers. You know what I'm saying? Fact. But see, the thing that we don't have is a song with Nicki and Cardi. We got one. No, but that that was, you know, that oh, was well, that's it. That was a that was a fluffing buff. You yeah, well, it was. He would Quavo was trying to make sure that was okay. But listen, I agree. But just as two women coming together, like, let's make this money. Yeah, fact. If they came together right right now and did a song together, they will break the internet. That's a fact. They will break the internet. It would be nothing sexier than a video with Nicki Minaj and Cardi B on that's their own accord. That's you know fact. what I'm saying? And to me, that's 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 childish. That's that, first of all, <laughs> that's, that's childish. childish as hell. Um, and you know, it'd be the egos and the comments. And see, I I love that comments don't get to me. And and y'all think just because we saying something about the comment, like. It's not about the comment. Yeah. It's the fact that people can't, people don't think that you can come together and create power. Exactly. Or people are afraid of you coming together and creating power, but you will never be able to stop it. All these YouTubers we've been reacting, we've mm -hmm. been reacting to for all these years are rich and boring as hell. I mean, just respectfully. Just got rich and just do what they do. And I say born because we don't have the entertainment anymore. All the entertaining things that they used to do, we don't have the entertainment. We get the seriousness. Yeah, you know what? And we get the music. And you know what? <laughs> that and we they, can't react. To. And you know what? And yeah, because you know YouTube copyright. I wish I can react to so much music sometimes. Yeah, okay. And it's just like that's what it really all boils down to, man. We just trying to get to the point where. I'm trying to do shit. Not trying. <laughs> we're getting to the point where we're making YouTube fun again. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it just should be that way because for so long, I feel like, you know, you be reacting to just so much negativity and it's just not I mean, it's fun thing. anymore. And I mean, I know that part, that aspect is never going to go away, mm -hmm. you know, but you can also just kind of try to make a balance out of things and just make it lit again, you know? And that's what I just feel. But it's crazy as hell that people would think that we wouldn't come together to get views. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I think that's retarded. Not even, excuse me, not retarded. Right. I think it's crazy. Yes. You know what I'm saying? To uh, to even think that. Of course we are. And um, wait on it. So I like to say, you know, anybody who have a problem with that, I, I 
you can't even respond. I don't to care like that. what you have a problem nice. with. I told her it's time for me to be obnoxious. I've been humble way too long. That's why I can comfortably get on here and say the content on here is boring. It is. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody has worked hard to get to where they wanted to go. And granted, you don't work hard to stay the same. So I did not expect them to work their ass off and continue to be on YouTube and just continue to give us entertainment. Hell no. Nah. But what I'm saying is it's time for somebody else to reign. Okay? And it's our time. So whether you like it, whether you don't, whether you praying for a fallout or whether you, whatever you waiting on, keep waiting. You got anything else to say? I have nothing else to say on that topic. You know what I mean? I just think that everybody should stay safe and drink water. Praise God and uh, hallelujah. <laughs>